Minoxidil is a medication that promotes hair regrowth in both male and female pattern hair loss. Today, we'll be answering the most frequent questions about this medication. Minoxidil's use as a hair regrowth treatment was, in fact, an accidental discovery. Initially, the drug was developed in the 1960s to help control high blood pressure. Minoxidil, during drug trials, was identified to promote excessive hair growth. As a result, the drug was redeveloped into a topical preparation to treat hair loss. Minoxidil belongs to a group of medications called vasodilators. These medications help dilate blood vessels and improve blood flow. How minoxidil works to promote hair regrowth is not fully understood. However, it appears to reactivate inactive hair follicles. It's believed to do this by reversing the miniaturization of hair follicles, increasing the blood flow to these follicles, and stimulating and extending the hair follicle growth phase. But how effective is minoxidil? For individuals taking minoxidil, around 40% will get reasonable hair growth, a further 40% will not lose any further hair, and 20% will not get any benefit. Is there anyone who shouldn't take minoxidil? It's best to speak to your doctor before taking this medication if you suffer from any conditions affecting the scalp, a condition called porphyria, or any conditions which affect the heart, kidneys, or liver. Additionally, minoxidil should not be applied to any areas of broken, infected, shaved, or inflamed skin. It is also not recommended for use during pregnancy or breastfeeding. Is it safe to take minoxidil with my current medications? Minoxidil may interact with blood pressure control medications. This is due to the drug's secondary effect of reducing blood pressure. Minoxidil, therefore, may augment the actions of your other medications. This puts you at risk of a condition called hypertension, where your blood pressure becomes too low. You may experience lightheadedness, dizziness, nausea, and fainting. Of course, this is not an exhaustive list. For more information, see the drug information leaflet that comes with your medication. How to use minoxidil correctly. Minoxidil is available over the counter in both solution and foam preparations. The medication should be applied to a clean and dry scalp, before applying, make sure you wash your hands in cool water and ensure they are completely dry. The desired amount of medication varies between brands, and you should consult your manufacturer's instructions to guide this. Typically, minoxidil is applied twice daily, meaning it's easily incorporated into morning and evening hygiene regimes. The medication should be applied evenly to the affected area of scalp and gently massaged in. Please allow the solution to dry completely before styling your hair or going to bed. After application, please make sure that you wash your hands thoroughly. How long does it take for minoxidil to work? It may be some time for hair regrowth to be noticeable, meaning that commitment to minoxidil's application is necessary. For most, an improvement is notable after four months of regular use. How long will I need to take my medication? Unfortunately, minoxidil does not permanently regrow your hair. Therefore, continued use is necessary to maintain the benefits. Individuals will experience recurrence of hair loss when stopping this medication. I've missed my dose, what should I do? If you forget to use your minoxidil on time, don't worry, just skip the missed dose. Don't double dose to make up for a missed one. I've accidentally taken too much medication. Minoxidil can be dangerous if you take too much, particularly if swallowed accidentally. Symptoms of overdose include feeling dizzy, lightheaded, palpitations and sleepiness. If you believe you have overdosed, please seek medical advice. Are there any side effects? Many people will not experience any side effects. However, as with all medications, side effects can occur. In the first few weeks of use, some individuals may experience an increase in hair loss. This is thought to be where the hair follicles shed old hair and kickstart the new hair growth phase. Persisting with minoxidil's application should result in subsequent hair regrowth. Common side effects you should discuss with your doctor are any local irritation to your scalp, which may include redness, burning, stinging, and soreness. Less commonly, people experience more concerning side effects. If you experience any of the following, please consult with your doctor urgently. Minoxidil can be absorbed through the skin, causing effects on the whole body. And these symptoms may include dizziness or lightheadedness, fainting, irregular heartbeats or even chest pain, shortness of breath, tiredness, weight gain, swelling of hands and feet, and undesired hair growth in areas unintended. Allergic reactions are concerning as they may be life-threatening. Fortunately, life-threatening allergic reactions are rare. Those with a serious allergic reaction should call emergency services for assistance. Symptoms of a severe allergic reaction can include swelling of the face, lips, mouth and throat, 
difficulty breathing, wheezing or chest tightness, and sometimes an allergic skin rash. Of course, this list is not exhaustive, and for a full list of side effects, refer to the drug information leaflet that comes with your medication. I hope this video has supplied you with the answers you were looking for. Thank you for watching, see you next time.